All right. It's Thursday, June the 16th, King of the Mountain State Show, presented by the Dutch Miller Auto Group. I'm Chase Hill. I'm here with one half of Saturday's main event, our professional main event, Jonathan Cooper. Hey, man, thanks for joining me here. I know that we've, uh, you know, this will be my first chance getting to watch you live in the ring, but you've been in the ring as much or more than anybody on this card. Before we get started, tell me a little bit about the amateur background there. I know you had a bunch of fights before turning pro. Uh, my amateur background, I started back in 2014, started in a tough man. Uh, after a tough man, Mike Chuck was like, hey, man, you want to go train and fight amateur? So, yeah. So, uh, within a year's time, I had 32 amateur fights plus tough mans. And then I decided to uh, agree to Mike to go pro in July 2015. I had my first fight at the Boneyard in Parkersburg, July 11, 2015. Yeah, so you start to put together almost 40 amateur fights, including that semi-pro stuff you did, and now you've had seven or eight pro fights, man. That's that's about as much as experience as we've seen. So being in the ring is nothing new, but you've been in the ring with some really good competition too. Yeah, you look at my box tracks, you look at my record, you look at the past three guys that I've fought, like the guy, uh, last guy, December uh, 5th in Alabama for that title fight, and Calvin Dickerson, uh, Tyrell Boyd, he's 6-0 and now, six knockouts. You're looking at all their records, you know. I've fought some tough guys, been into some wars, you know. So yeah. this – yeah, and you know you got to travel for a lot of those fights. You're not only fighting really tough competition, but you're staying in some hotel. You're in unfamiliar territory. You know your fans aren't necessarily there. I'm sure this time being close to home in a big fight with good competition, but you're you know you're close to home. It's a lot different whenever you get to fight there. Yeah, I feel more comfortable. I feel more relaxed and. Yeah, and, and your opponent, he's no stranger. You're familiar with Trey. Uh, you've been in a ring with him as far as sparring and stuff like that. So tell me a little bit about the matchup, what we should expect with you and Trey Stout. It's going to be a good matchup. Uh, you know, they're all good people. He's a good boy. Uh, I, know he's, I know he's in shape. I know he trains. He trains hard. Um, he's dedicated. Uh, we've been putting in the work. Uh, just, just know if there ain't a knockout, it's going to go the distance. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about your training. You're there with Mike Shepard up at the doghouse gym at Parkersburg, correct? Yes, sir. And, and Mike's a world kickboxing champ. I've worked with Mike for years. Um, I know that, that your gym has a big presence on this card. There is the Trevor Bells and the Justin Milams and, and different people. Even Joel Baker's up there a little bit the last couple of weeks. So what's it been like in the gym leading up to this? Man, we've been putting in a bunch of sparring, a bunch of cardio, Trying to get, you know, cardio is a big thing for me. Uh, when uh, we've been working on a lot of things, a lot of defense. So going into this fight, I'm going to be a completely different person than the past couple of fights that I've fought. It's pretty safe to say we're going to see the best version of you that we've seen, right? Guarantee it. Guarantee it. Well, and you know, that's how you end up main event. I did know a little bit about your experience. You had all these fights. Trey's kind of new. You've got more ring experience with him, but he's kind of an upcoming guy. You're both kind of local guys. So, uh, you know, it pays off in the box office and the fans. They get to see two West Virginia guys. One thing I don't like doing is really going out and bringing somebody in for a main event. If it's a main event, both guys should be somewhat, you know, uh, in the in their area. And, uh, and we're happy to have you guys for sure. Um, Whenever you get through with this, I mean, fighting, this is not just your last fight, right? You plan on doing this for a while. Yeah, man. yeah we're staying with it. We're going to stay busy after this fight. We're going to be hitting the gym hard. We're just going to keep, keep going. Yeah, so um, I know that we've talked back and forth with the, the ticket sales and stuff, your people getting on there trying to buy. It looks like you'll have some representation there. Looks like uh, you're getting a little bit of support. Tell me what that's like leading up to the fight. Man, it's nice having people locally be able to come to the fight, you know, support me. Uh, the past five fights I've had other than Trey Baker, the TKO that I got last May. Man, I've been going away by myself, not having no support other than, you know, pay-per-view. It's been rough. But uh, this one, you know, I might have, like, tons of people there to support me, uh, people in my corner. 
And, you know, that makes a difference, man. You got yourself in a tough fight late in the fight, third, fourth round, and you can hear – I mean, it does make a difference being somewhat, you know, closer to home than being out there on your own. I mean, I've, I've taken great fighters on the road to Texas, Vegas, different places. We were on the undercard of Mayweather a few times, and uh, it's just a, it's an uphill, uphill battle when you're on the road, and you, you got the advantage of being pretty close here. Um, the fight we're talking about is just two days away. Jonathan Cooper's half of the main event. He'll be facing off against Trey Stout in a professional bout. Uh, tickets are on sale now at fighterticks.com backslash king. It will be live stream pay-per-view at combatsportsnow.com. Man, I'm really glad you've been so professional. This is the first time, even though you mentioned we've worked together uh, when you made your pro debut. I was the chairman of the commission. I was up there for that. But this is our first time you fighting on my card. You've been very professional and good to work with. I appreciate that. That's what you want out of a main event, uh, professional in the ring and outside. Give me some shout outs or some thank yous or anything before we go at uh, everybody that's supporting you and help you get ready for this. I want to shout out to Mike Shepard, uh, Donnie Miller, Kenny Watson, Justin Milam, the people that's backing me, helping me in the gym. Uh, I want to, you know, everybody that's, that's come to support me. And that's. Hey, you know, Trey was trying to come down and wait for his debut. When this fight came together, he had to come back up. You, you might have a little bit of size on him. It's, good, it's going to be close now. Uh, you said you were training so hard you were dropping weight more than you expected to. So, you know, you guys are going to be pretty close. It's going to be exciting. It's exactly what I want in the main event. And uh, we're thankful to have you, man. Good luck Saturday. Um, and and put, a, put a show on for us, man. All right, man. Appreciate it. Thank you.